Hello, my name is Philip Cramp here with Rancher Government Solutions. I'm a solution architect, and I'm here to talk to you today about Rancher, RKA2, and K3S primarily. One of the things that we have is our Rancher Manager for Kubernetes, and we realize that it's a multi-cluster world. Most people aren't only using one flavor of Kubernetes, especially if they have a mix of on-prem and the cloud, maybe some edge devices. And so we wanted to make sure that you can have one approach, one tool to kind of deal with all that at once. So we create all Kubernetes distributions as first-class citizens and trying to make you have that one pane of glass, that one solution to kind of manage them all. When everything's siloed and you have different tools, different processes, you have your teams having to learn all these different tools and they have to context switch when they switch between environments. And so to try to simplify that, we want to give you one API, one pane of glass, one workflow that will work across all of your environments. And so being able to manage whether it's on-prem on something like our virtualization or harvester, vSphere or bare metal, or up in the cloud with AWS, Azure, Google, as long as it is a CNCF compliant Kubernetes, you can use this one tool to kind of manage provision, deploy, do your uh, access control, all that from a single place. And so this centralized management lets you have your edge devices, maybe vehicles, ships, they can be sensor pods, things like that. As long as they're connected, you can kind of manage them all together. And then we also have different tools that can be deployed across all these environments like New Vector, which is our security tool. So you can have that security tool ensuring that all of your clusters, no matter where they're deployed, are secured and, and safe. And so our solution is fully open and interoperable. We try to help you to avoid that vendor lock-in by making sure you have that single solution that can be deployed regardless of where you want it. And we support various underlying distributions as well. So you don't have to use our SUSE operating system. You can use Ubuntu, you can use Red Hat, whatever operating system you want, we don't care. And then uh, Carbide is our government offering that we do with Rancher Government Solutions. And this is just the, the kind of managed all together. And whether it's at the edge, the data center, the cloud, as long as they're all connected, you can access and control them all at once. And so what this kind of looks like is you've got this single solution. Um, you can, you're in your, your rancher manager. In this case, we just have two clusters, but you can see in this, even in the simple little cluster here, we've got a local cluster. We've got an Amazon one up in the cloud running EKS. You can see different versions, the number of cores, resources that are available. And then you can import existing clusters. If you already have some that are out there, you can also create brand new clusters. Uh, you just then have to provide your credentials for those environments and you can have it created. And the nice thing about that is that it gives you a nice, easy way to do that automated creation and destroy. You can also shrink and go to the clusters as needed. This is all done on a, a per node. So for your pricing, we've got based on the number of nodes and up to 64 cores, one to two sockets. And that's how you get to the pricing. So if you would like to get additional information, if you would need a quote, if you need a proof of concept, uh, demos, technical uh, descriptions, things like that, feel free to contact us. We'll be happy to assist you and get that information to you as quickly as possible. And just let us know what we can do to help. Thanks. <laughs>